we about to watch Blake head first. Yeah, y'all, go ahead. This your boy T. You know, I'm back at it again with another video. We go ahead and uh hit that like button on my uh, video and also hit that subscribe button like you do this, you know. And after you hit that subscribe button, hit this bell button right here. Real easy, you know. Let's do that. Don't unsubscribe, subscribe. And hit that like button just like you hit the like button here. So, let's get it. If y'all want to watch the full video, the link is in the description. And go follow me over on Twitch. And we're going to see what this song is about. The last song I reacted to, the lyrics was not all that good. Uh, so I'm going to hear what he's talking about. Uh, yeah. She got it. Fuck. I got it. Fuck. Yeah. I. Hey, yo, light up. Uh, I'm diving in head first. First. She got that wet work. Oh, baby, show me that neck work. Work. Don't no start seeing okay. head hurt. Oh, I don't know if I like this. Let me see. I had to work on my neck. I dove in head first. I heard this beat before. Head first. I'm diving in head first. First. She got that wet work. work. Baby, show me that neck work. Don't no start seeing head hurt. Hey, that big go hard. He he he's flowing on it right. She gotta be like a twenty-one seven or something, cause his his lyrics like. He don't know nothing about that, but, uh, you know. Okay. Now, that song right there, I can rock to. Now, would I listen to it in the club? Maybe. Maybe. Because, like, when you turned up, you don't even listen to the lyrics, to be honest with you. When you, like, turned up, you know, either you drink or you smoke or whatever you do, right, to get yourself lit. Like they say you drink like a bottle and you drink and you smoke at the same time. Some people do that. Some people just drink because they can't smoke in the area that they're at. But when you turned up, do you actually listen to these songs? Yes, and if you listen to these songs, you don't even listen to the lyrics like that. And if you do listen to the lyrics and you actually pay attention to the lyrics, it probably will sound good because you're drunk and everything sounds better. You know, or if you high, whatever you do, right? Everything sounds better. You know. But if I was listening on a daily basis, it's okay. It's an okay track, you know. Uh, will I give it the benefit of doubt? Would I play it in the club? Is it a club banger? Yes. Um, is the lyrics okay? Yes. The lyrics ain't on the top notch. It's not like the best lyrics I ever heard. But um, 
I say it could have been a better song. Everybody can do better. I need to hear more songs from this guy. This guy sounds like he got a lot of potential. He got a better he got a better soundtrack than this song. This this ain't his best song. He just put this out there to put it on World Start or something. You know, to get somebody to listen. Just have something for something to listen to. You know what I'm saying? And he probably been putting out tracks. Because this ain't the first time he probably put out a track. I can tell that he put out multiple tracks before. Um, the the track that I re reacted to before this one, I forgot what's the name of it. But it was like a West Coast vibe or whatever. And it's uploaded on the same day as this one. But uh, that one sound like that was a first World Star song. Somebody in there sound like that was a first World Star song. And the other person just had the money and he decided to invest and buy all the chain. Did all that just to get people to watch their video. You know, I don't think the song was that good. I just mean, this song right here is way better than that one. But I can tell that he's new. He's still new, too. He's still fresh. But I can tell that this ain't his first song that he put on World Star. This ain't his first music video. The way how the production is, the way how the song sound, you know, it, it plays a big part. Now, I ain't going to say just because. Now, I'm saying based on what I hear. Quality does make it sound like how long y'all been doing the thing. But I can tell that the other person, this person right here is more experienced. You know. The other person, he ain't that experienced with this. I can tell. Because I ain't hear nothing about nobody named Slim. I forgot his name. Slim B Feature 50 Rich. Yeah, there it is. Don't Love Me or something like that. I can tell that they made that in their attic. I ain't gonna say they made it in their attic. I can tell they made this underground. And they, they just decided to make a music video and they had enough money to put it on World Star or something. Because it don't sound like, you know, I don't know. I could tell that this is mixed and mastered better. So that being said, he been in the game a little longer than they did. Or they been in the game, but they just never have been heard until now. Um, that's just how it sound to me. Now, if y'all know who Slim B is, Slimmy B is, I don't know who that is until now. You know, I, I ain't know who Blake is until now, but the based upon quality compared with the other song, Blake has a better quality and he sounds like he been in the game a little longer. Like he, he know what he want. What kind of sound did he want? Uh, the other person, he did not, like the beat that he had, it's the way how he flowed on it did not sound right. Like his lyrics was okay, yes. But I didn't like how he flew on a flow on it or how the song was vibing like the vibe was different from this song like this song the reason why the vibe is so good because he flew he flew on it real good the lyrics didn't have to be that good but if you flow real good then i say it's an okay lyrics you can make basic lyrics you can make lyrics like drake drake make basic lyrics the reason why his song is so good because of his flow and the vibe so i just say this man go follow me over on twitch hit that like button and the link is in the description if y'all want to watch the full video of this video. And yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this song, man. But, I mean, I can rate this song. I ain't rate the other song because I, I didn't think it really need a rating. I think it, I need to hear more from Slimmy B. Uh, Blake, uh, I need to hear more from him too. But I can actually rate this song because it sound like, you know, he put some effort into this. That's just me, my opinion, all right? Uh, Blake, let me go ahead and tell you, man. Uh... The rating from 1 through 10, I give you like a 7, man. But I only give people 7 just to be generous, you know. So if you, if you get 7, you lucky because a lot of people, I'll give 6.5 to because they song ain't all that good. Your song is okay. So 7 is okay for me. Now, if you, if you ever get like an 8 from me, that means your song, either your flow had to been on point. And I'm comparing you with a rapper that, you know, one of my favorite rappers. And I can't give you that 8.5 or a 9 because they already got it. And, you know, if 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 you got you, I got to hear more from you. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I first hit NBA, NBA Youngboy, I did not really like his songs like that until he came out with uh, Never Broke Again. Um, I think it was, like, just straight singles of that. And he made it into an album or whatever, like, Outside of the Day and all that. That's when I started listening to him more, Through the Storm, stuff like that. that that's when you start hearing... NBA young boy change and stuff, but I need to hear more from you, Blake. And you made this video a little bit longer. Like I, I mean, want to think about like, hey, he should be, a, yeah, he doing pretty good compared to other videos that I do react to that new rappers be on. But yeah, let's get it. Hit that like button, subscribe. Yeah.